welcome to the first of the 12 days of Game Us. 12 days of Game Us is basically any game of my choice. I am going to do at least one level of it for each day of Game Us from Monday the 13th to December the 25th, Christmas. I hope you guys watch the whole series. And I hope you have fun watching. Here's Knuckles just being a jerk. Yeah. Does he even know why he wants the chaos in this? It's just Eggman saying, um, Knuckles, they're gonna steal the macaron. Well, I don't know why he wants the chaos in me. And I just learned not spring. Good job, me. Okay, let's jump over it and take care of that dude and jump on spikes. Yeah. Great. I just grab a hold of this vine. The other one. Okay, oh well, let's go around this loop, hit this ramp, which actually never gives you enough speed to actually hit um, the frame. First, let's take care of this baddie. Now, let's get this hidden invincibility monitor. So, you gotta spin dash while you're on the right side of the wall, facing the left. And then you get this. After you break the invincibility, there's a string that will appear, and you can also take this. You don't really need invincibility here, because here's just the intro for like the, um, this little thing, animation, with this robot that makes Angel Halloween get torched. I do not know why they put an invincibility monitor here, but now we're playing Torched Angel Halloween Zone. Was, wow, the springs are actually pretty hard to avoid. They could have just put one spring on the bottom to make sure we won't fall. But you could get stuck there if you don't know what to do as you're like a new player guy. You could actually get stuck there. So let's go down here, grab rings in the sloop, and go back on the platform even though there's nothing to do here. Okay, you know what? Let's avoid the platform this time. Leave the ring box here just in case I take damage, I may lose it. After I lose my shield, I lose some rings. But we completely don't take any damage. That's the best part of the double jump feature. But let's just break over to this ring box. For some reason, when you push on it and then you break it open, Sonic won't do the ball move. I don't know. But here's the mini boss. And screen lock too to render you from exiting the mini boss. Alright. This dude's easy to take care of. Just jump on top of him and just use directional control to make sure you don't go under him or to the left or to the right. And. That's the first act in the bed. I keep on getting, keep getting more score, Sonic. And for some reason, that didn't hit the sign. That fire shield didn't hit the sign. But it's fine, because I have enough score. And the score doesn't even really matter. But, hey, Angel Island Act 2. Let's go. We can still see the signpost just hanging out there. Anyways, this is a special stage. First special stage of the game or at least the first one i found let's go around and grab this so if you catch the red spheres you you lose the special stage if you get the blue spheres um you have to get all the blue spheres in the world this little what i don't know what you call it maze hub world i'm not it look, kind of looks like a planet because it's kind of curved it's a bit 3d uh, i guess you could call it a hub world Okay, so you've got to collect all the blue spheres in the hub world and try to not touch the red ones. Sonic goes faster and faster based on how many blue spheres you have, which makes it harder and harder. So also, later in the special stages, when the when you get like to the third Chaos Emerald stage or the fourth, there's a yellow spheres which act like a spring for Sonic to bounce him over some red spheres. But hey, we got a Chaos Emerald. Sick. Sonic got, and, yes, we know Sonic got a Chaos Emerald, because we saw it, guys. We saw Sonic getting a Chaos Emerald, so we know Sonic got a Chaos Emerald. Anyway, let's go back to Angel Island Act 2, and this thing just somehow collapses when Sonic goes on it. Fire Shield over the wall, water, so we don't lose it, and Fire Shield, and completely lose my shield, so let's get the Bubble Shield. Sweet. Now let's spin dash on that dude. I didn't even know he was there. 
and there are spikes in water for no reason. Spitting air spike thingy that are floating in the water. That makes no sense, guys. But let's, I don't know why I spin dash that much. And in hindsight, I don't know why I spin dash that much. I'm doing a voiceover way later from when I was playing the game. So in hindsight, I don't know why I didn't spin dash that long. But you know what? Let's grab some. Wait, why is Sonic hitting the wall? Quite a Sonic sprinted in the wall, and Tails flew through the wall. Dude, that makes no sense at all. Uh, yeah, hey, I'm so Sonic the Hedgehog, okay. Well, we got a lightning shield, which is much better than a bubble shield, because we can do that! Uh, oh yeah, and we can also go over the pit of spikes using the double jump ability, and use this, use this, what is that? Dude, why can't... I need to get to that platform. Uh, okay, we finally got to the platform. Take out this dude, or just, actually, yeah, we can't get through there. Let's double jump onto this dude. Take out that daddy and grab a fire shield. Okay, well, let's fire shield. Oh, you can't even fire shield through it? Okay, what do I do? I got dead, and then I fell, and lost the fire shield. Okay, so I can go through there. Hmm, I'm not sure, guys. Wait, is that a hidden room in the wall? I think there's a hidden room in the wall. Let's check that out. If I can ever get to it. Okay, so there's a switch. That'll drain the water, but it won't take out the... How does a hidden switch will drain water and it take out a wall? I did not know, guys. Okay. This platform... Most of the platforms in these games, for some reason, can crumble. I mean, seriously, guys. How is it possible that a platform just gets one hedgehog on it and it crumbles? Oh well, let's just jump right over the ring as if I don't need them. And do not forget about that ring. Or maybe we could get it, but Tails got it for us, so that's great. And go over here and completely make the block. But hey, we get a special stage that'll go in here. Alright, special stage 2. And we'll, wow, those are a lot. It is being very friendly to us. Look at how many blue spheres we can get just by he heading left, dude. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, dude. Alright. So that turned into rings. Oh, wow. How? This is very friendly, dude. Very friendly for a special stage. How many more blue spheres will they give us on a freebie? Oh, God. Dude, look at that. Just so many of these, dude. I'm not sure if I'll pass this. Another huge patch of these. Dude, this is being very friendly. So friendly, bro. And I feel like I've been here already because of those rings. So let's go head to the right this time and get these many blue spheres. Wow. Wow, guys. So that is cool, man. Pause, pause. Okay, guys, I get out of this waterfall, dude. Dude, it is so okay. I need, I need speed, guys. Spin dashes give speed, and I spin dash the wrong way into the wall thing. Oh god, it. Okay, this should work. Grab onto this weird platform that'll go in and out of the wall. Don't know why, but hey, guys. So let's right fall right back down. Yeah, that seems like a good idea. So let's try jumping on those weird platform things again. I don't know why that dude is just standing on that platform. Okay, let's try this again. Ooh, and completely messed up. Let's try it again. Guys, keep trying. And Tails just fell. Tails was trying to grow through the cracks. And, okay, I let's do something smart for once. Hooray! We actually did something smart. Let's grab a bubble shield and 20 rings. A ring monitor gives you 10 rings. So I just got 20 rings with two ring monitors. Whoa, 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 dude, dude. See, that's the bubble shield's properties. I just beat him by jamming the C button. Okay, let's get rid of this baddie. There's a fire shield hidden in the tree. See part of it. 
but most people miss it. I don't think it's possible to get it by bouncing. Let's try this. So wait, we got a fire shield. Uh, let's jump up here. I think there is. Okay, let's go, guys. Right through the rock and into the tunnel. And then we go right off of the screen because it's not a slap pack. Okay, guys. We do have to escape from these bullets that or missiles or whatever this sh the flying battery shoots. But it's not really a gameplay segment where you have to dodge things. You really just have to keep running and then it'll, by the time you get there, the missiles of that part will stop shooting. Okay, I think we're good, guys. Keep going, guys. There's this invisible wall preventing us from going through the end of the screen, but now we can go through the edge of the screen. Hooray! Okay. Hey, Eggman, take that. No, just one fire shield before you even come near me. Okay. Take that. Take this, Eggman. Whoa. Take that also. And also take... Okay, he went into the waterfall. Okay, take this, Eggman, and I died. Wait, why do I need to use... Wait, wait, hold on, guys. Okay. So at least we can... We get a fire shield every single time. So first take a hold of the baddie. And then grab a fire shield. And then let's do this. And one tap to spin dash through there. Through the tunnel and... Okay, yeah, the tunnel is blocked off a bit. But hey, let's keep going, guys. Same boring ship we have to do again. See the burning trees in the background? Is it? Am I the only one seeing that? I see burning trees in the background, guys. That is that is dark Sega. But let's keep going. Anyway, keep fire shielding, and you'll never get hit by the missiles. Keep fire shielding. Okay. Don't know why I went that quick there. But let's keep going, guys. Guys, let's keep going. Okay, fire shield Eggman once more. Take that Egghead. Yeah, and he's just acting totally normal about it. He's like, hey, I'm just using fire to burn down a bridge. Yeah, that's totally normal. Well, I nearly fell into that pit. Wait, guys, hold on. Let's keep doing this boss. And... Guys, I... And I immediately fire shield him. So I realized the first time I died because I forgot that you don't need the to dodge his attacks when you have the fire shield because his main attack is fire and I completely forgot to get the fire shield so now I just have to try and deal with it the ship is also going to be harder but it's fine because it's not even really a gameplay segment Tails just wants to go back Tails Tails why do you want to go back and get hit by the missiles it's much much easier to dodge these bullets with the fire shield because it gives you extra speed but it's fine Dude, there are so many bullets being shot out of this. Okay, I think we're good now. Now I have to remember, now I actually really do have to dodge it. The first time I died because I kept using fire shield, as if I actually had to dodge the fire, even though I have a fire shield. So now I just have to actually dodge it, and Tails is just, well, that's Tails. Yeah, he, he died, but he will respawn. Wow, Tails just, I just launched one hit out of him, and Tails just kept bouncing. Tails just kept on bouncing. Wow. I'm just controlling Tails here. He's kind of fun to control. You know, so you can just run him right off ledges and you don't even have to worry about losing a life. You know what? Just watch the capsule and the Sonic's idol movement. You know what? Kill Tails, yeah. And you know what? Okay, we entered the stage and. Tails is just still flying right above the capsule. Dude, his hands are hitting the blades. Isn't that hurting him? Oh well. Now he flies down to the cutscene. Where Knuckles becomes a, is a jerk again. And down we go. Okay guys. Hope you enjoyed the first level of the 12 days of Game Us. And I hope you have a good day. Take care.